All right, I am here at the Dusaba Museum. Yeah, here for the reading of the story of a saint, Mika story. Here's the script. Here's the facility. Oh, don't let me do it, but there it is. Yo, so I'm here at the Dusaba Museum. Oh, snap, James, that go one of the writers right there. James, and we about to do a reading today. A rehearsal for a reading. Story of a Saint, that's one of the writers back there. James Crumb, shout out to James Crumb for casting me in this. You know, it's life of an actor in a Chicago one. Y'all can get this like no other before 2023. We getting it popping. Hey, got the official reading tomorrow. And it's gonna be at here at the Sob Museum. I'll post the time and everything. But hey, we here, man, about to get this reading going. And I can't wait. I'm playing a guy named Shook. Hello, hello, hello. Stop reading. Jonathan, what's the deal? Hey, what's up, my man? What's happening? How you doing? Good, you? I'm good, man. Yeah. yeah, I started my blog this year, so okay. yeah, oh, nice. yeah, I'm about to be showing the life of actors nice. in Chicago because I just, I met so many wonderful people, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Oh, man, well, make sure you turn that camera on yourself, bro. Oh, yeah, exactly, I already did, exactly. you know? I started the video. Yeah. <laughs> but this is Jonathan. Yeah, hey, what's happening? What's happening, Jonathan? What's going on? Can you tell everybody who you playing? Yeah, man, I'm playing a gang of people. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, let's see. I am playing Poncho. Um, I'm playing Lil Willie, Mickey, and uh, Glenn. Oh, yeah. How yeah. I feel to be a part of this story? What you think about this story? The story's great, man. Like, I mean, it's a, it's a beautiful story about healing, yeah. restoration, For sure. and hope. And, uh, and you know the resilience hood, in the hood, baby. in the hood, yeah. <laughs> but no, shout like, out to all my people out there in the hood. Nah, I'm yeah, just playing, no, indeed, indeed. Yeah, no, it's just sure. a lot of resilience in this story. So that's what it's all about. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. And you, yeah. Mm -hmm. lovely lady, could you tell everybody <laughs> who you are? And... I'm Abby Thompson. I'm reading the stage directions for the piece. Oh yeah, how I feel yeah. to be a part of this project? What you think about it? It's amazing. Yeah, it's like it, the intersection of faith and her story and family and just her life and just how she overcame yeah, yeah. it's amazing it's a really amazing story oh, man, i can't wait yeah. this is gonna be exciting got new cast members coming in got the director over there this director teron Patton. It's huge. But yeah, so you so you did a play here, Emmett Till, you said? Yeah, yep, okay. yep, yep. It's um right. it, just a trial. Okay. Murder trial. We did it I did it with Collaboration Theater. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you okay, know, Mosley. Yeah. He directed it okay. and Dana Anderson. Okay. As well. She's familiar. Oh yeah, yeah. I've worked with her. I've worked with Dana. Yes, yeah, Carla Steelwell is the okay. producer okay. of it. And um That's yeah, it was here um last February. Okay. We did it. That's we had amazing. the uh Oh, Dana, who's the first with Anthony? And, and, it is a weird texture. We're talking about Black Eyed Peas. I didn't have to cook for uh, Thanksgiving and Christmas. We did like potluck style. Mm. So for New Year's, I'm like, oh, I'll go at it a little bit. Yeah. So I went a little hard. Yeah. What'd you cook? I did some lamb chops, some beef short ribs, some black, well, purple whole peas, some fried oh. corn, um, collard greens, and sweet potatoes. Mm. Mm. Now we had sweet potatoes, that's my jam right there. Man. Can I get I think to it's the game? So this is like the perfect season. Sweet, so, yeah. So some years ago, my daughter bought me a Harry Potter cookbook. So, Harry so Potter cookbook? How'd that work? So then, Wait, what? Oh, <laughs> How'd that work? You gotta let me see that. I'm gonna let you see what I made. Is it all snacks? I like beans, no. It's not. I made lamb. Like oh, butterbeer? Yeah. Like what? Yeah, I didn't do the butterbeer. We did that before. That we did probably juice potion. Yeah. Trying to give me some Gryffindor juice. <laughs> and I was like, I'm 
soup. I feel like theme stuff looks cool, but like the taste is not. You said you're vegetarian? Pes. I'm pescatarian. Yeah. I'm almost there. I'm like, you can have catfish. I'm like, I love, I love any fish. I love. I eat all fish. I could be pescatarian, but I like chicken a little too much. Well, chicken is the one meat that I thought about going back. I'm just going to be like 11 years. Because it's just, and every once in a while, I like easier for quick stuff. But, you know, I bet like a lot of tuna, sardines for snacks. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. So, I'm almost there, but. Yeah. I did give up pork Look, completely, though. Rome wasn't built in a day. <laughs> right. Oh, no. See, <laughs> now, we laugh for my family. Because I have a bacon problem. I don't care about no other pork. Do you need a tester? <laughs> like, somebody's just like, let me, let me, let me know how this tastes. It's like, I can't. Huh? I can't even smell it. If it's gluten free, can I eat it? It's like one of those things, yeah. I we don't buy it because my daughter should eat her weight in bacon. Like my five year old, she just thinks she's supposed to eat the whole package. See, I guess I'm, I'm like, when it comes to, when I say pescatarian, I literally, is that Steven? Whoa. Mm. What the heck? Why is this dude always popping up in places I just least expect? You and Steve always run into each other all the time. It's my boy right there. So I got Steve. Renee. All the classmates coming in. Gerard. Rusty said hello. Rusty, Rusty Sherman. Oh, shit. That's my acting coach. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's my acting coach. She told me to tell you what's up. See, Rusty? I told him. So do you, bro. Hey, Hey, buddy, coming on, man. Wait, what is that? Some of the stuff. So I made cucumber sandwiches. Okay. You see, I did a cheese ball cauldron. Okay. And there's guacamole coming out. Uh -huh. <laughs> and I used peppers as the fire. You was having a good time. Okay. Just getting full out with your Nick, Max, and Patty Wax. Give a dog a bone. That's huh? just the appetizers. That's not the dinner. Oh, that's, <laughs> wait. So can we see pictures of the lamb chop? I'm sure. Okay. Are you sure you're pescatarian? Let me see. No, I'm, I look. I, like I still love food? to see people. I love yeah, to look yeah, at food, yeah. and I love to see people yeah. eat the foods that I used to love. Like, I can't get the video. To I went from. Like, I, and I was so happy when I found out. Like, like full okay. pescatarian, you know like saying, eight months. Oh, okay. Because I was vegan at first. Like, okay. I went straight vegan to drop like as much weight as I could. And then I went, I just like, I was like, I can't do just plants no more. I need meat. I was like, I need meat. And I love fish. And, and shrimp and everything else. Yeah. Steve, what you, what you doing here though? Like, what you working on? You read? If someone needs to read, I'm the only home reader. This is my brother. What's happening? You know what I'm saying? I'm vlogging. Getting my boy. Happy New Year. With the academy. Oh, man. Yes. Oh. I like that. Did you get that at Moose at Sunrise? Uh, no, no, no. I feel no. like you were selling it on the That is wicked. He gave me one. He gave me one. And so this was uh, made by a uh, wonderful person named Ra. And they uh, it's called Ra Crystals on Instagram. Ra they're, Crystals. Yeah, R-A-H. They're out in Atlanta, but they'll ship out. They'll customize. This was customized That's fire. to the point where he was like, you know what? I've fallen in love with it. I'm going to give it to you for free. And I was like, what? I, it, yeah, so I like that a lot. It's a blessing, man. I'm glad to see you, bro. Oh, I don't think you're a brother. Yeah. Who you reading? Come on. No, no. I'm cool, man. I'm so glad to see you, though. It's on, man. Oh, man, I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm trying, man. You got to give me, you got to teach me some martial arts, though. Yo. Give me in the back with the sticks like you was on that one video. I got, so I'm at a new school. Where? Um, right here on 95th. Uh, Dragon Boo, uh, Dragon Budo Jiu Jitsu. And so, the teacher, his name is Grandmaster Stark. So, brother, he's a Grandmaster, Hall of Fame inductee, with a record of 89 and up. Damn. Like, yeah, I need him, like, to be mine. And he's the coach Sen Sensei. of the Team USA Judo team. What? He's on the coaching staff for us. So I'm like, and you work with him? 
I just started, I just had my first day yesterday. How was it? <laughs> man. I'm out of shape. <laughs> <laughs> man, I remember one video, you were going crazy in the back with this thing. You still do that? Like, what is it called? What is it called? Staffing? Uh, that was bow staff. Yeah. I need to go back at that. Bro, so. you was nice on the tree trunk stump. Getting it. I'm like, oh, girl, what that, the heck? Yeah, that's Remember like, you in the back? Oh, I forgot what video it was. Like it was a long time your, ago. Uh, that's like the tough in your forearms. Yeah. And just, just, it just toughens your body. So like, when normal people hit you or something, like, it won't it's like it. a wall. Okay. But it's like, yeah, see, that's what I mean. Yeah, because today, oh, I am sore. I am so sore. Oh, man. It's going to be great, though. I'm going to be a Dusabu an awful lot. For the next two months. Word. Yeah, we got the uh, Emmett Till. Um, it's going to be here? Come in here. Yeah, yeah. It's going to be for a week. Oh. Oh, please. Please let me. I you have no clue. Know. It's, it's, it's come, bro. I got you. Okay, but I'll, I'll take it. I'll, I'll, I'll get like can you give me two coming? free tickets. All yeah, the time. Yeah, I'll get like two free tickets to show. Let me know what show you want to come to. I got you. Uh, is the schedule already up for it? Yeah, it's um, the February 9th through the 17th. Steve played me in my first theater play being produced ever. Like, An honor. Played me. Like, honor. This, so this is like my brother. Like this is me. Like, I am him. <laughs> I am him. He is me. I love you so much, dog. Love you too much, man. It's, it's, it's on, man. You said February first. No, no, seventh, ninth. Through the yes. Through the seventeenth. Seven shows. So all you gotta do is just pick whenever you you guys wanna come. You already know. Through. Renee. Hey. Gotta get you you filming? Mm -hmm. yes. <laughs> hey. Huh? It's moving. It's How you like, feeling today? Oh, I'm fabulous. You look beautiful. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. She was my first grandmother and my first ever theater play yep. and I love her dearly. And now he got an Emmy. What can I say? I taught him well. <laughs> she did. She did. Everybody that I was with, they all taught yeah. me well, but this was my my one. Oh, see, it keeps twisting. Yeah, it keeps twisting, but yeah, there it is. It reminds me of the drone. Right? But it ain't broken down. <laughs> yeah, this one ain't broke down. The drone. She's all somebody told me you sent them a copy of that movie. I didn't send it to you. Somebody said you sent them a copy of Broken Down Girl. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I did. I don't know who was it. I know I sent Regina. I, I sent it to Regina. I sent it to. You came. I'm sorry. No, I just I, my hand was up there and I didn't know where the seat. No, I was talking about you came to uh, the premiere. Thank you. I know. Yeah, because me and, and Jay Nicole sat back there and acted completely. I know. <laughs> we was howling, yelling, screaming. Yeah, was howling, yelling, screaming. Teron. <laughs> this is Teron, the lovely director. You know, she making it happen. You know, Captain. trying to keep up with this brother right here. You know what I'm saying? I got to make some stay what, on what my the story, phone. What's tell him what the story means to you? Like, oh, man. The story all. means everything. Like, this is like my childhood. Like, for real, for real. But yeah. telling it in our own words. So that's what it means. Oh, ooh, that's the music we're having to? <laughs> right? I want the world but, to go. Yeah. Uh, Oh. Did you get back? You just got back in town. Yeah, yeah. yeah I remember he told, told us you was you was out of here. You was, yeah. Good to have you back. Huh? I haven't been, I don't think I've been in this theater. You haven't been in this theater? I, now we're right I, past the snack table. Yeah, like, I don't know if I've been in here. Been in here. I don't remember. It's been so long. So, 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 so. Meatball, marinara. We got, we got shit. Frito-Lays. Exactly. Take off. 
Oh, man. Oh, that's what I'm saying. I don't know which one to pick. Let me grab those. Ooh, well, cheese and crackers. There we go. That's good. I'm, I'm bougie. I gotta have the meat with it, too. <laughs> Give me the salami. Mm, true, true. Salami. Felicia Rashad and Kenyatta, the man who made the Broadway play, the Tupac play for Broadway, holla if you hear me. I never even heard of that. Yeah, because it got cut short. That. It got cut short. And it was it was bullshit. It, it should have it should have stayed longer. Why did it be cut short? You know how they be doing that good. It was that good. good. All the lovely people. I'm going to have to be down here right here, brother. Come on. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'll get next to you. Oh, wait. Hold on. Where am I going to put this on? Where you going to what's going to happen, explain it to you the law of the land of what's happening. So we're going to have minimal lights, we're going to have video, and we are going to have blocking. But what I mean by blocking would be like very minimal. Like basically you move it from the chair to the stand. That's what I mean by blocking. Right? And when you go back, there's going to be a line of chairs in the back. So basically... All of you all are going to be all the all the mirrors of her mind. So your backs are going to be to us until you come out into the pool of light to where it was happening. Mm -hmm. And then you or you or D or the three of you will be observing in each of these three pools what's happening. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to play with if we have enough time. I may even make us have us do a couple of funky tableaus. We're gonna see. We're gonna see. We're gonna see. Okay. So let's um start at um uh, on page thirty one. Um, Abby, for now, go ahead and read it. And what I've done is I've made notes, and I'll give it to you separately as to what's being read. But for right now, just read it. And then what I'm gonna do finish what I was doing, which was worlds of being the staying your own element. I love it. I appreciated it um, because another mom asked the question, like for me, like as a mom, I was like, how did you pull this off with having children mm -hmm. and still being an artist? She's like, my lady came with me. Mm -hmm. And I got to that, like, why does my whole world have to change and shift just because I have children? They just go out to come for the ride. Mm -hmm. So if they in their pajamas when I need to be picked up from my school, they can have to be in their pajamas. <laughs> Yeah, they fans. Mm. But they just want to come back. Why well, smell like people chicken? You smell it? It smells like yeah. yeah. Like not, not even chicken. It smells like the a, a, a church out. You know when the church cooking downstairs on, during service. That's what it smells like. Yeah, I smell it now. Like I smell it the more I step over. I smell it the more I step over here. What's going on over here? This is it. This? Am I the only one smelling that? Yeah. It's my food. You know, how, you know. How. You know, and there I did smell when I was in there. Like that, somebody like fried chicken. I smell like chicken. That's what I'm saying. I know I was smell, I'm smelling church chicken. Y'all know how that. You know, I, I mean, I can't eat it, but it, it still smells good. You want some shrimp? Nah, I do though. I do. <laughs> Don't get me started. I can eat some fish all day. I ain't gonna lie, especially fried fish. Yeah, yeah. I got to. I have to. I can't. Uh, I mean, especially when I had went vegan. Or you had to. I had to. I only did it for like three, four months. I started losing too much weight. Then I was like, it's over. Yeah. yeah. Hello. Yeah, 
Yes, I tell you. Museum. This is a nice neat exhibit. I don't really know what it's for, but let me see. Sabo Museum. Be so good that they can't annoy you. I know that the time is always right to do what's right. Yes, my king. Turn your wounds into wisdom. Dream with your eyes open. Perfections are blessings. Yes, children will make history, educate yourselves. That's right. Uplift the community. This is very positive. Jack and Jill up the hill. Nice tree. Even the grass don't need well. This is turf. It feels like like real grass. Yo, <laughs> yo, you thought she was gonna get fast? No, I was man. just gonna play it. No, 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 no. Hey, man, it's gonna tell them who you playing. Oh man, what it feel like to be a part of this urban story. It, it's actually pretty dope. I grew up on the west side of Chicago, so I Let grew up around. Too. Yeah. Huh? I don't know your name. So. Oh, I'm Simi I Henderson, everybody, and um, I love Chicago. Born and raised in West Side of Chicago, and I'm gonna be playing a few different roles. Um, Michael. Uh, grass, those are the two I'm really, really, really yeah. excited about. But um, doing this project is really cool because it's history. And not only is it history, but it's telling the story of how someone can come from from nothing, overcoming drugs and jail, to becoming a doctor, and then telling their story for the betterment of the community and the nice. betterment of the world. So super dope, super dope people in it, and I'm super excited. Yeah. And I'm about to steal his shirt from him. It's uh, what, <laughs> Tupac 1995. Yeah. Dear mama. Yeah. See you later, guys. Okay, sir. Appreciate Peace. it, bro. Yeah. You in here, man. Just... Man, I know. I just, oh, bought, I just bought it, man. It's like $100. It feels, it's, it's perfect. Like, it makes you look at how smooth you got yeah. 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 It's perfect. Yeah, I can. I got you. The DG, right? Is it the DG? DGI. DGI. Yeah, yeah. 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 So we're like, basically, we're, we don't work together, but basically, we're together. Um, and so we're like, we just want to like, pray for our people. It's not really necessary. It's really not. And plus, I mean, I Square area. It was okay. like it was like the office.